What is up my flawlessly kings and queens Welcome back to my channel As you guys can see by the title You already know we about to hit it off with CJ So Cool Back in the click today you guys Now the last time we talked about CJ He was going back and forth with his baby mother royalty And then he had his little girlfriend And he broke up with her Now allegedly, supposedly, they're back together However, that's not what we here to talk about Okay, CJ is in the click And he is under fire from a lot of people And it's just giving sick Okay, so I'm gonna I'm just gonna say before we even get into what's really tea, trigger warning. Okay, it's gonna probably trigger a lot of parents, a lot of mothers, a lot of fathers. So if you watch this video, just understand that it will be triggering because CJ so cool decided to take it to the internet and show that he's cutting his daughter hair, right? She got box braids in, obviously some extensions in her hair, and he cuts it and records it and posts it online, okay? Simply because his daughter allowed allegedly was at a party where it was 21 years old and over now you will be seeing him in the video asking his daughter why would she be twerking and why would she be at a 21 year old and part or over and party but i got a lot to say so y'all already know i make my reservations and y'all know we most definitely gonna always talk about it take a look did you see what your daughter kamari did at the party bye of course, me being the dad that I am, always on social media, of course I saw what my daughter did because you guys made sure I saw it. And not only did you guys make sure I saw it, me and her mother had a long talk at 3 a.m. about what she did, and then we got on the call with her grandmother. And that is when I decided that when Kamari made it home, I was going to make a spectacle of her. Now, click, I had to pause it because let's really be for real, okay? The first thing that he did wrong, first things first, is why are you coming to the internet? I get that you are getting paid to come to the internet to tell your business and just be you but this is very personal like this is your daughter she's at a 21 year old and up party twerking on video okay with a whole bunch of adult men and females around and let's really clock this C real quick. I feel like at the end of the day, this is all on Nike and this is all on CJ. Because why is your daughter at a grown adult party and you weren't aware of it? Okay. It's so many um things happening out in this world right now. Children are still getting, you know, going missing every day and nobody puts an amber alert out. Okay. With all these things going around, you would want to make sure that you hold on to your child tight, right? And make sure you know exactly where they are and what they are doing especially if they are the age that she is and correct me if i'm wrong isn't she like 11 years old how are you 11 years old and you are at a 21 year old and over party and for him to come to the internet and talk about how he's going to make a spectacle out of his daughter when he really should be making a spectacle out of himself when he really was doing that because at the end of the day you're embarrassing yourself as a parent and don't be coming in the comment section talking about oh queen let people be alone, leave them alone Don't talk about how much a parent could be And don't let the parent just parent the way Shut up hey, Call your mama, period this is the reason why that's the this is the reason why everybody be out here parents and we, we gonna call these type of people social media parents because everybody think the right way to do things is always running to the internet what is the internet going to do but get you in trouble but get you to be talked about in the click news let's really really talk about it sick can't stand y'all okay this is all over now so we can all it's free reign for all of us to give our opinion whether you like it or not i'm gonna give my opinion and i'm just gonna talk my stuff because at the end of the day we can help one another by trying to give advice and helping people because at this point it's clear that they need some type of something in that household because if he gonna sit here and talk about you talk to the grandmother you talk to the mother but then you come to the internet and thinking this was the answer you mean to tell me they all agreed because he, he didn't personally say that he they agreed to what he was doing but he did say we had a talk so my thing is y'all thought this was okay coming to the internet whether he was cutting the braids and her hair ain't that long or not it's just why do that that's just not that's horrible parenting in my opinion do this i doubt your hair is that long <laughs> Ooh, virtual per er, real bad then you shouldn't have did that right huh yeah yes yeah, she should have no, I should never did it. Okay, hold your hair, cause you come on. 
baby, please. No, no, no. I want no ball. Lord Jesus. Can't stop. Because you need to stop twerking. You dumb? Pardon me? Are you dumb? I, are you, dumb. like, medically speaking, are you, like, like, I'm not trying to be mean. Like, are you dumb? Are you so I'm guessing he thought by cutting his daughter hair and humiliating her in front of the world and posting this was a way to teach her from stop twerking, going to clubs 21 years old and older. In my eyes, this is not okay. Point blank period. Not, I've seen a lot of people say, you know, he should have kept this behind closed doors and not put this. He shouldn't have done it at all. He should have never done it at all. This is not how you parent, okay? Especially a young girl, a young queen. This is not what you do. You have broke the trust of your daughter because instead of you being a father and letting her know that twerking is just not cute and that she's on punishment and do it the right way, you rather sit here, cut her hair. Itself. Talk about her hair is probably not even that long anyways Like what father says that And then you hold her face And you say I love you But click to be real This next clip really was definitely disturbing What he said Take a listen Need help throughout we got big booty, strong arms, strong leg. Now, click, I don't know about y'all, but why would you be telling your 11-year-old daughter that she got a big booty and all this other? Considering the fact that you keep on bringing up the fact that she was twerking and you didn't like the fact that she was in a, an adult club. I don't know, click. CJ um, is definitely on some crazy edge. I think he definitely needs to reevaluate himself. And I think he definitely needs some therapy because something is wrong with him. Because my thing is, what would possess you to go on the internet to even do something like this? Knowing that you you have a huge platform full of kids because you got to remember he started that channel based off of him having a family with royalty and her children before he even had the twins with her so for him to sit here and do this and post this he has gained so much negativity and comments towards this okay and before we get out here and, and, and introduce who's next in the click i do want to read some of these comments because i'm not going to lie to people was eating him up sir this is beyond weird let me break it down one she would never forget to your punishment could have been private not this however i'm a parent and it's your child however not your right this poor baby gonna think it's okay for dudes to belittle her and treat her like this so great job dad either way tell the baby i'll rebook and get them done obviously the braider now masika said horrible parenting shaking my head disciplining your child for youtube views and instagram likes is insane this is sick shaking my head now click this next person said everyone's saying what she should have could have would have done she wasn't in embarrassed like how many of us got embarrassed publicly before social media existed our parents used to beat our a right in front of our friends drag us out of parties and cuss us right the f out in public like stop acting like black parents especially aren't just as embarrassing all around the board we grew up black our parents ain't care where we were at we got treated if you acted up this isn't the worst thing in the world all he did was cut her raggedy a braids and make her do four push-ups no, 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 no. That is it. Uh, 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 uh. We gonna pray. Yes, click. We gonna most definitely pray for this person because this is the type of ignorance that really boils my blood. Now, yes, I do agree that most people, parents from back in the days, definitely reacted irrational and inappropriate because I'm gonna keep it real. The way I was treated when I was a child by my father was not okay. And no, I'm in no way, shape, or form trying to blame my father for my mistakes as an adult, okay? But I will say that all my life I was searching for love and the wrong places and I thought when I was getting abused and being treated disrespectfully that that was someone telling me that they love me so at that point I think a lot of people need therapy to think that because you were treated worse that what he did wasn't that serious and was right because that's not the case in my opinion CJ did it all wrong and kings and queens let's just keep it real okay one thing about me on this channel I'm gonna keep it real I'm gonna always express myself I know anything I speak on is because I've been through it and I'm just really asking that if you think that that is the way that you should teach a child 
then you are sadly mistaken and you need help as well. If anybody is out here really defending this man's actions towards his child because they've been through worse as a child, then you definitely need help. Because let me tell you something, we didn't deserve what we got when we were young. So if you were a young child and you had a hard childhood, that's not our fault. Our parents been through childhood traumas as well and they brought it into their parenting. You are supposed to break the cycle, point blank period. So if you think about doing things like this to your child, and thinking that your child is going to learn from her wrongdoings then you're sadly mistaken because all this did was further break her down point blank period yes I have talked about Kamari before in the past because this is not the first time we talked about her actions and her being fresh and her being a, um, a, a little grown for her age even her mother even admitted that she knows her daughter is, a, is grown and can get little flip with the lip okay but who fault is that that's her parents. Your child is a product of you. Now, when you become an adult, you are responsible for your own actions. As of right now, she is a child. And if you let your child be free at 11 years old and don't know where she at, then the parents need to be evaluated, point blank, period. Now, click. Neek Bay had something to say. He said, lost the trust of your daughter great job dad i would never risk my connection with my daughter by embarrassing her for making a mistake and i click this person say yo what the f is wrong with dude you literally conditioning your daughter to believe that a man hurting embarrassing her equates to love but then going to be outraged when she end up in a relationship with an emotionally abusive man her thought process will go like this my dad acted like this towards me and he said he loved me so this must be okay break the trauma Break the curse. Stop embarrassing and exploiting your children for monetary and influential gain. That ish is sad and sickening. This person said he didn't have to record or post this ish. I get punishing, but publicly embarrassing your child just to make content is effed up. She been grown as F. Her Instagram is Kamari Fine. What 11 year old girl need to be referring to herself as fine? Pretty, maybe even cute, but fine. Blue Ivy would never. Beyonce would have a fit. Now, click the reason why I think this is just an ignorant statement is only because a child is a product of their environment, point blank, period. Whatever she's around is what she picked up and now she portrays that, period. At the end of the day, you cannot sit here and come for a child, okay? I'm not going to be upset at a child. I'm going to be upset at the parent. Why? Because she is a product of her environment. Whoever she is around is influencing her. If it may be her mother, and if her mother's not paying attention to her, clearly somebody, the parents are, somebody dropped the ball. Because why is she in a club at 11 years old popping her butt? Now, that club should be shut down because anything could have happened to that little girl. She could have either got blank in a bathroom anywhere. Anything could have happened to this little girl. And y'all mean to tell me you don't know that your daughter was in a club? You know what? That's all I'm going to talk about, Click. Y'all let me know in the comments below what y'all really feel about this situation. I know this ain't my child, but I'm going to make sure I always make my reservations. And you know we're going to always most definitely talk about it. Call your mama, period. Got me over here tight, excuse me, what? And I really don't care what nobody got to say. I think that parents of 2023 should switch it up and change it up okay start being a parent stop allowing your child to do whatever they want to do and then want to try to punish them and embarrass them in public and you've been allowing this girl to be running free everywhere come on 11 years old it's clear that she runs free if she in a club and you ain't know that she was there anyways y'all y'all already know what it is if you guys are new make sure you guys are smashing that like button do not forget to hit that subscribe and do not forget to turn that post notification bell on so you could be notified when i drop the click news on the road to 100k november 1st i see you guys tomorrow in the next click news and if nobody told you that they love you today just know that i love you i see you guys bye